across this beauty. I know I'm here for, for the Ducati stuff, but I mean, come on, I'm a Kawasaki guy at heart. Maybe one day I'll own one of these. All right, next ride, Multistrada 1260. I got another bike lined up for this one, after this one, but right now, since this was just an open bike, no one's jumping on it, eh, might as well ride it. So, dual sport, I, well not dual sport, I think it's like a, it's a, just a naked bike, a 1260 though. Thing looks nice. Man, this thing is tall. Well, not as bad as I thought. I can still touch the ground. <laughs> You turn this thing on. There you go. Nice. This, now this is what I call spending a Saturday. It's riding bikes. I can't flat foot it, but I'm tiptoeing it so which is the best I could get <laughs> as a 5'7 tall person it's a nice clear display it's got Bluetooth and shit damn okay I don't know how to do all the settings and stuff so I'm just gonna leave it alone I'm definitely feeling some heat right here damn I'm definitely feeling some heat well I mean once we get going hopefully it Air and all that will help. Thing's got some giddy up, that's for sure. Oh, I think we're waiting for the rest. This thing might like to wheelie, I'm not gonna lie. I built the throttle like just a little bit in uh, first or in second gear, and it's oh, feel it pull like immediately, instantly. I mean, I'm not that experienced in riding yet, so I don't want to like accidentally do that, so I gotta watch out for that. 12 seconds later. Man, this thing's got some pull. Well, this thing's got some pull. God damn. Okay. This thing's definitely got some power to it. Even if it's not tuned to be like a sport bike or anything, it's that power, that torque delivery on the low end of the RPM spectrum. Man. This is officially the biggest bike I've ever rode in terms of like engine size. But again, I'm not used to- Woo, shit! God damn! I will admit that this is a little less extreme, a little less, uh, 
Well, it, it's it's oh goddamn, no f given. The right position on this is a little bit mm, easier, I, I guess, on the body than the monster because it, oh, it's a bigger bike, obviously, but the legs aren't as crunched, you know, scrunched. It's it's somewhat windy today, but I mean, the aerodynamics are pretty nice. Nice, nice leaning in. Oh damn, I didn't know that. There's a, I guess there's a sensor on here that if, if it senses no light out, it turns dark like the, the, the color switches. That's kind of cool. Hey, I got your wheelies on this. <laughs> Jesus, can't underestimate this thing. Damn. <laughs> Damn. But just like the monster, the clutch, it doesn't really engage till the very end of the pull or of the, of the release. I mean, which is, you know, it's fine. It, just something you gotta get used to, I guess. Pretty gnarly crosswinds right now. This thing's got some smooth power to it. I could only imagine <laughs> what a sport bike with this type of engine would feel like. I'm not ready for that. That's why I'm skipping over the Panigale 1299. <laughs> the V4S at that too. I could definitely see see uh see me using this as like a a bike that I would like to you know take across country or something just a just a chill ride cruise across the long ways throw some bags on it you know hook it up with some protection maybe oh an exhaust on this thing would be sick too ah oh, yeah oh man it flicks around pretty pretty easily. I feel like this bike looks bigger than it really feels after like riding it and sitting on it and all that stuff. I will say the the shifting lever you got to be deliberate when uh, going from two to two to first. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Oh, that's not a monster. That's a hyper mo hyper motard. That's what's up. That that's that's what's up. Uh, that's man. Yep. It's one of the best super motors you could get. And that's how it sounds stock. Really? Huh? Hey, is that a scooter? Not saying I'm gonna switch brands, but I mean, these Ducatis are definitely okay. No, where's neutral? Come on. Nope. There we go. Ugh. Oh, shit! Yeah, damn it! There we go. Man, there we go. Multi Strata 1260. Pikes Peak Edition, I think. Damn, I think it's hot. Damn. Well, that's it for this test ride. Thanks for for watching. I got one more, one more lined up. At least one more lined up. So stay tuned for that video.